like non-stop by the way. I want to take a, a second to pause here. It has been thundering so much lately. Lightning, lightning last night to the point where there was a freaking lightning storm. It rained and thundered and thundered and rained and rained and then it, it lightning to the point where it was almost daylight outside for about an hour and nine minutes. Like literally it looked like it was daylight the cloud was so big full of lightning right over the uh, the current bullseye of where i am and it just was just scary and then you can hear it, it was like it was crazy like the thunder sounded like they were dropping bombs it was so nuts i, I wondered if i'm even here still is this real uh, and it's doing it right now at uh, 9.35 in the morning, in the a.m. I can mention the time it was earlier, so I'll date June 17, 17, 2019. And I'm watching the current Lupin predictive programming. Lupin the third, uh, the fifth, first episode of the newer season. You can find it if you do the research. The predictive programming behind it is featuring a LARP plot where Lupin has been portrayed as this internet star who has this like following and people are, 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 are uh, tra tracking him and seeing and betting where he's going to go and what he's going to do in a sense where it's like with the information that Lupin the, the you know Lupin the third has and knows you know being a world renowned thief and a, you know and, and it goes into the uh, conspiracy that you know celebrities have been some of the best spies out there in the world you know t t tell me I'm wrong about that but some of the best spies in the world have been always claimed that they were uh, ambassadors for uh, you know a actors or actresses acting as acting as ambassadors on behalf of the United States obviously obviously and uh, it's 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 quite telling you know that they are all the predictive programming in, in every type of media doesn't matter where it's from you know it's there that the uh, the story the arc of following this character through social media means and uh, waiting for somebody to post a video about what may or may not have happened to your favorite character who's no longer in the game anymore <coughs> uh, you know it's it's just one of those things where you kind of like you know you just you have to really meticulously meticulously you have to really really sit down and think about it you have to like just get down to the gritty gritty and the nitty nitty and go go beyond your comfort zone your boxes your walls whatever it is and just uh, reach deep down there and, and know know that it's true understand this is a game this is a big old plot something was written and discussed way before the man walked out on the scene you know uh, this is so dope. I'm, I'm, I'm a big Lupin fan, you know. I, I've, I've watched the franchise forever. I'm the kind of guy who spent 55 bucks to own a DVD of five solid movies of Lupin the Third. Uh, you know, what, what do you do? You know, it, uh, money, money is a construct. I'll, I'll do a whole nother one about that where, you know, you only believe in it because you, you've been tricked into that. You play the game. Playing the game. Um, back to this other, this, uh, this other LARP, <laughs> this other ruse, this uh, uh, switcheroo here. Uh, I, I want to be honest that the uh, to me also I, I do think when you hear the the terminology, let's say um, <coughs> dead man switch, uh, dead man switch, dead man switch. All right, uh, everybody wants to be happy. Everybody wants to be happy, you know. Oh yeah, some of us do ha have been doing this. It's all right, we've been watching. We're here. We're here. Can't be quiet no more. It's time to say something. Uh, so yeah, regardless of look here it goes. Look, this is the part right here. 
it shows all the people that are tracking him, who watch the videos, who look at that, got him on your Instas, your, uh, oh, look at the comments, oh, he's doing this, oh, he's doing this, oh, he's doing, look at this, look at this, this is the predictive programming, look, look at that, that's it, that's, that's what's going on right now, if you, if you are sitting behind a screen uploading some type of theory, some type of video, some type of, uh, you know, opinion, analytics, your two cents, whatever you want to call it, about the mother effing Isaac Cappy. It, it's it's it is what it is, you know. If you if you if you're following it, you're playing the game, you know. You don't you don't have to believe me. You don't have to. Uh, you don't have to believe me. You don't have to. Uh, you just don't, you know. But uh, it, there's evidence, right? There's proof in the pudding. There's all kinds of things that uh, resonate with people, and they think, hey, now, you know, um, I've experienced these types of, um, uh, you know, um, encounters with other humanoids uh, slash uh, credence slash freaking uh, sewer skink rat whores you know um, it, it's it's a thing it's a work in progress I'm trying to be better to what's left of humanity but uh whatever you may be whatever side up down left right southwest over and out you know wherever you stand uh, remember that there is a there's some type of humanistic nature that binds us together and uh, we share this, uh, we share this monkey punch. <laughs> but I, th I think I've, I've de de uh, digressed from the original concept of what's going on with the, the Cappy uh, and this uh, connection that I found between predictive programming and Lupin the Third. Um, you know, it, it's there if you watch this. It's it's pretty much there. Um, I think it's cool. You know, it's it's something that none of you are looking at. And, and and once again, I don't think it's uh, anything that's going to give you any uh, closure or comfort to anything. But it, it may it may enlighten you, or it may help you to know that uh, maybe some of these things that we talk about, uh, you know, definitely show up in uh, you know entertainment format, regardless of its animation or a Hollywood movie. You know, these plots are coming from something. There's an old wise tale that uh, what is it? The uh, the best cons uh, the worst conspiracies are the ones that uh, people seem to know about, right? So uh, I think you know if they were conspiracies, people probably wouldn't know about them. Maybe something, something to that nature. Uh, you know, I'm not a very bright person, but I've seen some stuff. Not happy. Uh, however, uh, on a side note, uh, to to advertise and give a little praise to Lupin. Whew, man, still stellar animation. Oh, always on point always fun uh, you, you know what you know you get what you get and uh, Lupin still manages to always be cutting edge and if they are using this uh, a LARP script this LARP plot to uh, assist a little bit of this uh, this arc that they're doing here with this Lupin then damn you know uh, it's out there predictive programming is real you know I guess so right who knows who who cares um, you know it may or may not help it may not but uh I guess that's all I really wanted to say about that. There's really nothing I, I know truly right now that I can help you with. I have to get get with my inner self and figure out what what's what, you know. But, uh, you know, have a good day. Do what you do. Or don't. Uh, you know, hopefully these uh, thunderstorms don't get me. They, they feel like bombs. They feel like bombs. And they feel like bombs um yeah it's an odd feeling when you see things and you start to think you know I would never have uh, imagined that that would be a thing uh, um I just would never imagine, man. I got I guess I'm stupid, right? <laughs>
I'm a stupid motherfucker. Yes, I'm a stupid motherfucker. Alright, 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 I'll leave you alone. I'll let you go. I'll come back later. So we'll see what's up. Got some things in, in store in mind. A couple of uh, weigh-ins, I guess, right? Is that what we're calling them? Weigh-ins? Oh, uh, yeah, you just wait.